four phases of disaster management. Preparedness, response, recovery, mitigation. Preparedness, actions taken before impact, including plans and preparation for disaster. In this phase, emergency action plans are developed to be followed when disaster strikes. Volunteers are recruited from the civilian population to help as first responders. When disaster strikes, a more planned procedure is followed by the professional responses. Construction of shelters, installation of warning devices, creation of backup lifeline services, for example, power, water, sewage, and rehearsing evacuation plans are important aspects of preparedness. Response. Actions taken during the initial impact include those directed towards saving lives and preventing of further damage to property. This phase involves necessary emergency services and the first responders are localized. Firefighters, police and ambulance get into immediate action and may also be supported by special rescue teams. Volunteers and non-governmental organizations, NGOs, may join to provide practical assistance. Recovery. Actions taken after initial impact, including the efforts directed towards bringing life back to normal. This phase involves restoration of the affected area after the immediate needs have been met. Rebuilding destroyed property. Re-employment and the repair of other essential infrastructure. Mitigation. Activities that reduce the impact and of the disaster damaging effects. This phase attempts to prevent hazards from developing into disasters or to reduce the effects of disasters when they occur. To focus on long-term measures for reducing risk. Various mitigation strategies are applied